Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my week 37 update of my fitness journey. So this week has definitely been a lot more challenging because I wanted to get in the swing of things. Also, when I do my food update, um, you'll know why I made this week a little bit more challenging. So like normal, I'm just gonna go through what I did this week and then we'll get into the updates and chitter chatter and then the photos. So starting off Saturday, you guys know the deal, don't really work out, took the day off that day i don't even know what i did on saturday to be honest sunday i did the day three of the 30 minute plan so that includes the 15 minute abs the 10 minute upper body and the new five minute stretch so i really like the five minute stretch it's very short sweet simple um, and on Sundays, I like it to be a little bit more easy, but I still want to be productive. So that's why I just did the 30 minute workout. And then on Monday, I did the day two of the sweaty hard plan. The day two of the sweaty hard plan includes the 15 minute six pack, the 10 minute hit workout, which is the hardest thing ever. I still can't get through it. And then I chose the Jason slash happy sweat. I chose the Jason one and then I did the abs and yoga. I don't know why she always puts the abs and yoga. No offense. That's like one of my least favorite ones. It's just so slow and like, I think it's good because it's like slow and controlled, but honestly, I'm not a big fan of it. And then Tuesday, don't work out. That's a work day and teriyaki Tuesday. You guys know the deal. So I don't do anything on Tuesday. Then on Wednesday, um, I did the day one of the sweaty hard plan. And that includes the 12 minute booty, the booty activation, legs in fat burn and the 15 minute booty. And when I was doing this one, I did not realize my legs are weaker than they look. Like getting through some of those was really difficult and challenging for me. And then Thursday, I didn't do anything. So um, nothing to show there. And then today, Friday was a really challenging day. I did the day six sweaty hard plan and it focuses on the abs, upper body and hit. And oh my goodness, guys, I'm so tired right now. The day six includes the eight minute six pack, the upper body, the calorie killer. And I chose to do um, the 10 minute hit workout. I didn't choose to do any of the dances. Uh, the dances are really good if like I'm super unmotivated, but honestly, I am completely fine with just like doing the workouts and not including the dances. I think the dances are really good if you just wanna get some physical activity in in your day and you don't really like want to work out if you're not very like active then I think that the dances are perfect for that reason but other than that I'm pretty good with just sticking to the workouts moving on to the updates oh my goodness so in one of the future videos you may see in the future either Monday or Wednesday it's part of my vlog but we went to Animal Kingdom walked around a bit it was super rainy and then we ended up leaving because the park closes early and a gracious subscriber viewer sent me some treats they're called stroop waffles if you do not know what a stroop waffle is it's like heaven in your mouth it's food from the netherlands i believe it's the netherlands at least she sent them from the netherlands to my p.o box which is freaking insane and again thank you i say thank you a lot in the other video but i couldn't get over it she sent me like four different kinds and I have been munching on those all week including my family so we have not been very good when it comes to like eating healthy I have been on my fit life foods but you know then you just throw on two stroop waffles and then bam you canceled out all your hard work so I tried to pick workouts that were more challenging this week because I knew I was ingesting a lot more sugar and caramel sweetness and cinnamon oh if you don't know what a street waffle is, again, you need to look it up. It's um, spelled S-T-R-O-O-P and then waffle. Food wise, yeah, not, not so great, but it's not every day that you get food from a different country, especially during a global pandemic. So I definitely, I'm on my like, one of my last Stroop waffles that I'm probably gonna eat today. Also, I wanna talk about my butt. Okay, this is weird. I've been doing more booty workouts. I kind of dedicated now Wednesday to working on my like legs and butt because 
I kind of want, you know, more of a peach butt, and I don't know, my butt's just always had like a weird shape. I mean, I think it's kind of normal, like it's not like super flat, but it's not like, you know, nice and bubbly. Um, but I've been doing, I've been focusing on a little bit more from the past two weeks, just working on my butt and the workouts and everything. So I'm just gonna put some pictures on the screen. This isn't like part of the workout update progress photos, but they are progress photos when it comes to my butt. Here they are, they're on the screen right now. So the one on the left was taken September 19th. This was kind of like before I started doing butt workouts. And then here is today. I don't know if that kind of looks the same, but today is October 2nd. They're not very far off. You can kind of see it's a little bit more um, bubbly in a sense. I don't know. There's more definition like where my leg starts from my butt, if you get what I mean. I don't know if it's the angle or not. Anyway, those are kind of like my butt photos. <laughs> so weird. When I do those leg workouts and the butt workouts, I feel a lot weaker than I feel like I am. I don't know if that makes any sense, but when I'm doing them, I'm like, my legs feel like they're gonna fall off. It's like no joke. So I'm gonna keep on working on the legs and butt, just maybe it'll get better in the future and stuff. Maybe the workouts will get easier. I swear the 10 minute hit workout is not getting easier for me. Like every time I do that one, I'm just like dead. That's why I always do that one first. So I just like get it out of the way and do the hardest ones first in my routine. Now moving on to the photos. So Alex on the left is last week. Alex on the right is this week. And honestly, I feel like the Stroop waffles went right to the stomach. Um, here is the side view of that. I don't know, man. Um, no progress here, no progress. And then um, here's pre-workout Alex. So pre-workout Alex is on the left and current Alex is on the right. And then here is the side view of that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment the question of the day, which I haven't even mentioned the question of the day. But the question of the day is, what is your favorite type of candy? Because mine is definitely the Stroop Waffle, probably. You can get Stroop Waffles at Target, but they don't come in the cool flavors. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.